And here's the BBC micro bit. Uh, this is ARM Cortex M0 Plus. So hi, so who are you? Uh, I'm Neil Cooper, I'm the uh, brand and corporate marketing manager at ARM. And uh, this is uh, BBC, and this is also BBC. This, so this is the uh, BBC Micro, which was launched in 1981 in the UK, uh, made, by Ac made by Acorn Computers. And uh, just over a million of them were sold to British schools. And a lot of uh, whole generation. So this of was kids. For, this was for kids in the eighties, early eighties. Yeah, early eighties, and it, actually it was a uh, it was in British schools for for pretty much the entire age, right up until the nineties and the very beginning of the nineteen nineties. And this is this is where all of our employees were. Uh, what's it called? Uh, educated. I'm yes. Joking. Yeah, yeah, no, absolutely. No, so our CEO, um, Simon Seegers, has fond memories of taking this computer physically apart as well as creating um, programs on it. And it created a whole generation of, of, um, of programmers. And then what we did is um, working with the BBC, Freescale, Nordic, um, Samsung, and Microsoft, we've launched the BBC Microbit, which will come out in uh, January next year and will be given away free to. Um, a million 11 year olds in the UK. One million 11 year olds, that means all the 11 year olds all are going to get All the 11 year olds entering, so as, they, as they've entered kind of high school or senior school, they'll um, get one of these and they get to take it home, it becomes their property. Uh, they can code it themselves, they've got buttons on here, they can create games, they can add accessories on there as well to, and to broaden the uh, number of things they can do. And uh, so how does it, where, where, do, where do they connect, what, what can they do? So on board you have an accelerometer and a compass built in, uh, Bluetooth low energy, and then, um, and then you can add other accessories on. So just over here we've got an example. So this is a BBC microbit connected to a um, moisture sensor in a plant and a pump with the water. So uh, it's not working at the moment because of uh, no water on the, st on the, st on the stand. Um, There's no water in California. <laughs> yeah, 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 it's run out, we weren't allowed to yeah. use it. Um, and so what it does is it detects the moisture and then we'll send the, and we'll make the, uh, the water into the plant. Nice. So it's a great, so, the, so this, uh, this is going to be like a million different ideas or what? We hope so. We hope that there'll be, kids will do all kinds of stuff with it. And it's also, the key is that you, it's instant, so they, they, they can code it. And this was the this was the appeal of the original micro, in that you could, within five minutes, you could code the you could code the computer to print your name on the screen a thousand times. You nice. can make this very easily um, scroll your name across the LED display. So, so the future tech billionaires and millionaires of the UK would have started on this. They're gonna come out of that. Yeah, yeah. So at the TechCon in 25 years time. The, uh, the keynote person will say that this was the what inspired them to create their... The British Google. Absolutely. The British yeah. Apple. Yeah. Yeah. Hopefully. All right. So January, every kid gets one. How about other countries? Are they asking for it too? Uh, I think they're going to see what happens in the UK and then... And What's then the price? Don't What's know. the cost? It's not, at the moment, there's no commercial details. It's just free? It's free for 11 year old, 1 million 11-year-olds in the UK. And beyond that, I don't know at the moment. Right.